Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a spring kind of day in the life homemaking and also decorating with me as usual because I'm gonna be styling new decor and also adding new items that I got for my home and also uh, some items that I got to complement the new sofas here at the living room. We are also gonna be decorating the powder bathroom here downstairs and adding some items to decorate the office room. So we have have a busy day in this video and I hope that you enjoy and you got a lot of inspiration and ideas for your spring decor and without further to say let's get into it hey everyone thank you so much for being here I'm so glad having you in a brand new video and I'm starting by our living room this is my real life so I thought this would be the perfect time to tidy up this area and show you the real situation before adding the new items in the core because not all the time my home is looking perfect and I always need to do my tidy up and cleaning routine even before filming a video or or a normal working day so picking up and putting away my kids stuff animals and all the things and this messy throw pillow situation and by the way my kids are loving this air rack and I honestly I'm loving it too uh, because it is so soft it is so plushy it feels great under feet and thank you so much for all your suggestions because I was asking you to tell me if I if should I um change this rack and uh, finding another one and you told me that this was totally okay uh by the in fact that you were liking it so much and honestly i'm loving it and also my husband loves it and he says it's feeling so cozy and great underfits and i'm so happy with this every rack i purchase and overall with the change in our living room and thank you so much for all your nice and kind comments comments and your suggestions and i also wanted to take advantage of this cleaning routine and giving this new area rack a good vacuuming before adding the new items that i got for our living room And now that our living room is already clean, I wanted to add this new ottomans from the dress hall with Studio May collection I just received. And I ordered the Lingwood upholster ottomans in the light brown window pane plaid. So I'm trying them here at my living room and see how they look. And I wanted a subtle color to make contrast and this light brown are the perfect neutral and soft brown color and it goes perfect with my earthy color palette in our living room and I also did realize they match with the light brown accent pattern on the new area rack. This window pane pattern is very fine and you can barely notice unless you are very close to it. But the main reason I wanted this ornaments is to have a way to put our feet up and make ourselves feel more comfortable when we are spending time here in our living room since we previously had recliner sofas and honestly we are very used to it. I think they offer a versatile and practical way to style and use it in any room but also they can help to make your room more finished and in my case help to complement our new sofas adding that extra comfort so you see me here trying them and see if they can really add that comfort that I'm looking for and definitely it's what I need 
so i will be linking these ornaments in my description box in case you are interested in these ornaments or you are looking for something similar to add to your living spaces And next I'm coming to this side of the fireplace because I'm gonna be doing some changes here in this decor and now I would like to make the change and adding this beautiful and very practical scalloped woven tray from Marshall and have the perfect size for this area. Not only adds that organic touch, but also it's very practical so you can put and keep items in like remotes or I also liked it to add a large candle or other decorated items. And I love those scallop woven trays so much that I wanted to bring home both small and medium size. And the medium size is perfect for this area. And I'm changing the woven tray that I added before from the Hobby Lobby. And I'm placing this medium size scallop woven tray to put in this faux set on flowers arrangement that we did in our living room spring decor. The scallop shape adds that sweet sweet and beautiful visually interesting touch according to the sweet look of the flowers and this medium size looks much better here than the previous one. And talking about woven trays in practical everyday and spring decor, I also wanted to do this change in our primary bedroom by adding a larger woven basket. Not only helped me to add that warmth and charming item to this white and empty corner, but also these baskets are perfect to storage so many things and in my case I'd use it to storage those cozy chunky blankets that we need to have on hand during these cold spring nights in an early mornings and I can perfectly fit up to three blankets here so I thought it would be a practical decor item for this season and also the everyday use. And after doing this quick change in our bathroom, and now let's move on to our kitchen. And I'm bringing the outdoors in and I wanted to add this real hanging plant and my favorite herbs and doing a little garden here. I got this beautiful baby bunny belly straight Scania at Walmart and I'll be also linking in my description box so you can have more information about this. But since it's still very cold outside, I wanted to start bringing the outdoors in and creating a little garden here inside and starting the spring here into my home and this white kitchen window nook it's the perfect bright spot to add those real plants since there's plenty of sunlight that is coming in through this window so I'm first starting by spraying with some water to not oversaturate this plant and hanging in front of this window and I really like the look of this plant. It looks so beautiful and it's bringing all the spring vibes to my home. And I wanted to also add my favorite herbs to this kitchen spot in front of the window. For now, I just was able to find ground rosemary, but I'm adding more herbs as soon as I find more. And this is not only a perfect way to have a natural source of fragrance into your kitchen, but also it would be a practical way to keep your favorite fresh herbs on hand when you are cooking. But it's also a pretty and natural way to decorate those sunny bright kitchen spaces and spring it's the perfect time to start growing or propagate herbs you commonly use in your kitchen
using the soil that I already had on hand and I got the ceramic planters and the ground rosemary at Walmart they're both very affordable and easy to add to your space I'm still keeping here my glass face with baby breath and opening the shades to let all the sunlight comes in And this is the look of this window nook with the new plant addition and also I'm showing you a wider view complementing the kitchen spring decor and you can also watch that video from my spring decorating series. Now I would like to add some practical decor items to our powder bathroom that is, looks bare and plain so first I'm adding this artificial olive stem arrangement by the threshold with Studio Maggie collection or spring collection this year at Target and I'm also adding uh, this scented candle that you can perfectly use as a storage canister if removing the candle inside this is also by dress hall with studio mcgee from the spring collection this year And I'm also bringing this beautiful marble tray by the Heart and Hand with Magnolia a collection that I got from Target and I also styled in my spring kitchen decor but you can use this tray in many ways and areas to place or stand things on it like in my case I'm using here to place this Coco Lavender Scent Hand Soap that I got at Marshall and then this stunning real marble scallop bowl that I got from Amazon and it's so practical since I can use to drop off my yearly but also I would like to put in my organic eucalyptus bar soap that would add that natural artisan look along with the handcraft marble bowl and I got this pretty and neutral floral hand towel that would add that spring floral touch to this bathroom And then you know how I love woven baskets because they can be a great function decorative addition and I like this one particularly that I got at Walmart because you can remove the smaller basket dividers inside and use it as you prefer to fit larger things but I'm using it to storage our toilet paper and I can perfectly fit to large size toilet paper in this one which is awesome to keep them on hand and the rest I'm keeping them in the cabinet under the sink so that if we have guests they will need to be opening the cabinets and just grabbing that from the baskets and next on top of this little shelf about the toilet I would like to make it more practical and I'm just adding first that small woman tray that I got from the Target dollar spot last year and I'm adding in an extra hand towel so that I would have this one on hand whenever I need to change it for a fresh new one since i have all our hand towels upstairs in our laundry room storage and then i would like to add that tissue paper but to make it more visually aesthetic i'm covering the packaging box with this woven tissue cover that i got at target and i'm also keeping the variety of woven textures that i really like for an organic spring look Thank you. 
But then I got this oil fragrance diffuser featuring a woven basket with flowers from Bath and Body Works that I'll be also linking in my description box and I'm using the rose water and ivy fragrance. And then adding those little touches with this Real Baby Breathe and this is the view after adding those Spring Practical Decor touches to our powder bathroom. Even though I'm adding the Spring Decorating touches, I still wanted to keep this bathroom simple and not to clutter but at the same time practical for the everyday use and everyday decor. And next I'm coming to our home office room and this room it's feeling very empty and I also like to keep it like this since our office room tend to get colored so easily so I'm starting by quickly dusting and wiping down our desk and tidying up this area and then adding some touches of the spring decor. I want to apologize for my very raspy voice but I've been going through a severe cold and um, sometimes I know that can be difficult to understand me but please bear with me and hopefully the next time the next video would be better but I'm struggling to do this voiceover right now without coughing and trying to keep myself as normal as possible. And after doing a quick cleaning on this desk, we can start adding the decor. And I'm starting to decorate by adding my vintage terracotta face by the Studio Magie. And I'm also putting back our family picture. I will be linking that terracotta face that I got from Target if I can find it because it's so pretty and goes really well with any decor but I'm also putting this very affordable gypsophila stems that I got at Target and I'm also going to be linking them because they are not only perfect for the springtime but also you can use it year round and also for the summertime but for me this decor is so practical because these items also help to hide the electric devices and the wires we have on the desk and I'm bringing that wooden razor tray by heart and hand and then I'm adding this candle by the threshold collection that I got at Target this year and I love the scent perfect to light it and having a relaxing office working time And then I'm adding this rounded woven basket that I got at Hobby Lobby two years ago and unfortunately I haven't seen it anymore. I think it is very practical and so pretty. And I'm adding a face to put in this beautiful faux pennies in a soft pink blush that I got last year at Marshall. So as you can notice, I'm reusing my decor. And then I'm adding this faux fiddle leaf fig tree that I already had and I was standing at our foyer next to the front door and I got maybe two or three years ago at um, GA Max, but I wanted to bring it for our office to add life to that empty space next to the mirror. And I'm also repurposing and reusing this woven tray I had in our living room decor and I'm placing it on this small space on our desk. This can be so practical since we can keep things we are using to work like our portable screens, files, our iPads or books that I'm currently reading and or adding your office supplies that I've been adding in this master little face or also would be the perfect open area to place on and light my candle while I'm working 
in here. And this is the end result in a wider view of our office room after adding those spring touches and practical everyday decor. And that would be it for today's video. I hope that you enjoy and you get a lot of inspiration for your spring and everyday decor. And see you in my next video. Bye!